to come and briefly make your remarks. Your Excellency, the Deputy President, uh, William Samoy Ruto, and also uh, the fifth President of the Republic of Kenya, uh, the uh, party other party leaders, uh, SGs, party officials, ladies and gentlemen. Today, Farmers Party is very happy to be here. At last, we feel that the farmers of this country have finally found a home. And what we know is that the farmers of this country, uh, which is actually the majority, have felt that the leadership has abandoned them. They have seen that in what we've been seeing, the prices of the commodities are coming down, the prices and payment to farmers coming down, the costs that farmers have to pay for from the costs of inputs to all the other costs coming up and escalating, as we have seen with the cost of fertilizer. Farmers feel that a lot needs to change, that they are tired being at the bottom of the pyramid. Today, the poorest among us are the farmers. When the children are being kicked out of school, it's the farmers' children that are kicked out first. When people are unable to pay for their medical bills, is the farmers at the front line of being unable to pay their bills. And as such, we feel that this uh, Kenya Kwanzaa will be looking at the interests of the farmers who, are, as I said, are the majority of the Kenyans. Your Excellency, in Kenya Kwanzaa, we hope that you can make farmers a priority within your structures. And for that to be done, there are a few things that we need to think about from, for the farmers. First is that agriculture was devolved and is a devolved uh, function under the Constitution of 2010. And as such, we need to empower the county governments and give them a lot more support for them to be able to support farmers and work with them closely. And for that to happen, there are things like extension services that were killed after the 2010 Constitution. We really, that's why the farmers are getting very low yields. That's why the farmers are unable to be clear on what they need to do uh, to increase their earnings. Your Excellency, we also need to look at things like value addition. Uh, why is it that Ethiopia and the others have coffee uh, factories, uh, processing factories, and for us, everything we export in raw form? The farmers in this country will benefit the most when we start thinking of how to increase the payout to them. Uh, Your Excellency, uh, given my age, I'm 39 years, so I will consider myself youth or youthful. As such, I will, it, will, I will, it, will, it will be unfair for me to leave the stage without mentioning something about the youth. The youth of this country are also the ones who have been left behind. Every place we walk, wherever we visit, they are the ones, they are jobless, they are hopeless, they are penniless. Also, they have no skills or competencies. We need to empower our young people. We, really, we need to give them hope and something to wish for and live up to. Your Excellency, for us as Farmers Party, once again, we are very happy to be here. We are here willingly and we are committed uh, to help drive the Kenya Kwanzaa agenda and your agenda across all the farmyards in this country until you become the fifth. Thank you very much. Thank you. It's a turn, it's a turn now for the Communist Party, the Honorable Wandawiro. Come and kindly make some brief remarks. Raisi 
mtarajiwa wa Kenya kwanza pamoja 